Hey YouTube, welcome back to the channel today. Really quick video tutorial showing you how to create a SharePoint list out of an existing Excel document. Um, pretty simple process. What you wanna do is come to your SharePoint site where you wanna create the list, click on the new button over here, and then click on list. So from here, we want to click on the from Excel option. And now we're gonna hop over to our Excel document. As you can see here, I have kind of a template document with names, ages, job titles, and then an email. Important thing to know is that your data has to be in a table. So since my data is not in a table, we're gonna go and select all of our data, go up to the insert tab and then click table. Uh, since our table does have headers, we're gonna leave the my table has headers option checked and we'll just click okay. Now we're gonna go and save our Excel document and head back to SharePoint. So from here, you're gonna to wanna to click upload file and then select your Excel file. So if your Excel document has multiple tables, you can select them from here, but ours only has one. And this is showing you how the data is going to import so you can change the type of column it's going to come in as. So let's say this number, we wanna to convert to a single line of text on import. Uh, we would just go ahead and then click next once we've reviewed this. And by default, it's gonna give it a pretty weird name. So you just want to clear that out and then name it whatever you wanna call it. So for this video, we will just call ours Excel to SharePoint. Uh, and then click create. So it shouldn't take too long depending on the size of your list and we can see now that we have our new Excel to SharePoint list um, all uploaded. A couple things to note, this does not link directly back to our Excel document. And another important thing to note is that the row limit on this is 20,000 rows. So if you do have data that's over 20,000 rows, this method is not gonna work for you. So this is something that might be really helpful for companies that are migrating older Excel processes into Power Platform solutions, leveraging SharePoint lists. Thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like and subscribe and leave any comments if you have any questions. We'll see you in the next one.